Hey guys, Candice from Crema Coffee Garage here. Today we are going to be comparing two of the most popular batch brewers on the market. The Mocha Master Thermal Coffee Brewer and the Precision Brewer from Breville. But just before we get started, I want to remind you to subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit that notification bell to be the first to know when we release new video content. Okay, let's jump into it. If you are a regular of our channel, you will know that we have already done individual video reviews on both of these brilliant batch brewers. But if you are new here, first of all, thank you for joining us and welcome. Second of all, I encourage you to simply click the I in the top right hand corner to be taken to the more in-depth reviews on each of these machines. The reason I suggest you check out these first is because this video is going to focus more on what sets these two machines apart from each other and inevitably, hopefully, answer your question on which is a better suit for you. Physically looking at the two machines, they appear to have a lot of design similarities. A thermal carafe, a shower head, a removable filter basket, and a water tank. Both machines make a range of quantities of delicious batch filter coffee and are both certified by the SCA, which is the Specialty Coffee Association, which means that the internal heating element heats the brewing water to between a recommended 90 and 96 degrees Celsius. However, if we begin to look closer, we start to see where they differ. The Breville is made up of complete brushed stainless steel casing and the water tank is a large 1.8 litres in size, meaning you can make up to 12 cups of coffee. The Mocha Master water tank is slightly smaller, coming in at a 1.25 litre, which would be considered 10 espresso cups in size. However, a great pro in the Mocha Master's favour is that it is majorly made up of BPA-free plastic, handcrafted in the Netherlands and designed to make parts easily accessible and replaceable if need be. For this reason, Mocha Master provide a whopping five-year warranty on this brewer, whereas Breville provides a two-year limited product warranty on the Precision Brewer. Where the Breville really differs from the Mocha Master is its versatility in brew methods and also the level of customization that is available to you, its owner. It offers up to five preset brewing modes and a custom mode that is appropriately named My Brew. And this gives you the ability to customize your bloom time, flow rate, and your water temperature. However, one of the five presets is the gold standard brew, which has been programmed to the SEA standards for you, producing a delicious filter coffee that is very similar to pour over. And speaking of pour over, you can also purchase and attach a pour over adapter kit as well. All programming and customizing is navigated using the LCD screen and dial but you will also notice the smaller auto start button to the right. This gives you the ability to preset the time you would like your brew to start. This is perfect for early risers or those with very limited time in the mornings. You can get everything set up ahead of time, the night before for example, and the Breville will begin the brew at that preset time. The Mocha Master has a single switch function to get the brew started. And then the main control over the brew comes with the adjustment of the valve on the front of the plastic cone filter. However, this is mainly tailored towards the quantity of your batch as opposed to the brewing variables. Although there are little tips and tricks you can use to customize your brew when using the Mocha Master. Circling back to the filter baskets, the Breville offers a variety of baskets to suit the different brew methods and quantities that it offers, along with provided paper filters. Whereas the Mocha Master simply requires one universal filter basket in conjunction with a paper filter for all brew quantities. Both brewers have the ability to make more individually appropriate sized quantities of coffee, not just those larger batches. You just need to ensure that your water to coffee ratio has been adjusted to suit the smaller batches. And this is a big pro in both the Breville and the Mocha Master's favour, as they're not isolating any section of their consumers. Moving down to the carafe, and as previously mentioned, both machines have a thermal, food quality grade stainless steel carafe. This aids in the heat retention of your brew, which is ideal in the larger batches, especially in a larger home or an office style environment. Where they do differ is in the design of the lid. The Breville enables the lid to stay on during both the brewing and the extraction process, whereas the Mocha Master Carafe comes with two types of lids, a brewing lid and a transport lid. The brewing lid is similar to that of the Breville, 
but it has what's described as a mixing tube attached. And this enables a homogenous brew, and then you can pour from this lid without having to remove it. However, for maximum heat retention, I recommend that you use the transport lid, which the Breville, however, does not come with. Both machines are relatively easy to clean. The filter baskets and the thermal carafe can be washed with hot soapy water and the shower heads can be removed to be washed also. Although I will say that the Mocha Master is a little bit easier to remove. You just need to ensure all parts are rinsed and dry before putting them back together so as to save from any unwanted moisture buildup. When we look at the two different batch brewers and compare the quality of the end result, which is always a delicious filter coffee, it becomes very hard for us to pick a favourite. So we won't. What we will say though, is if you are someone who likes being in control of all the elements of your coffee and experimenting with different methods and variables, then the Breville Precision Brewer would be perfect for you. If you prefer to be able to pour in your coffee, fill up your water tank, flick a switch, walk away, and still end up with a delicious filter coffee, then the Mocha Master is your guy. We hope this aided in your decision making between these two awesome batch brewers. You can't go wrong with either of them, guys. Both are available on our website, cremacoffeegarage.com.au, where you will find a fantastic and substantial range of amazing coffee products. But don't forget to show us some love on our social media pages and tag us in your home and travel experiences. Or if you've already got one of these guys at home, send us a video and show us how you do it. And don't forget to send us some suggestions on products that you want us to review next. And as always, thank you so much for watching, guys, and happy brewing. Cheers.